I'm here to share with you this highly anticipated and requested video, which is my morning routine. This is my summer routine, actually, and let me know in the comments down below if you would like to see a night routine. I bet that video will be pretty fun to watch. And I'll try to make this as realistic as possible, so without further ado, let's move on into the morning routine. Oh, great. I was having a nice dream, too. Why? It's 9 o'clock already. Gotta stretch a little here. You're probably wondering why I use a manual alarm clock rather than the alarm on my phone. And that's because my phone isn't loud enough, so I'll sleep through it. It's also farther away from me. Not only that, but it's on airplane mode for health reasons. I like to go on my phone for like 15 minutes. Okay, I lied. It's longer than that. Which is bad because I tend to get lazy and when we're about to go somewhere, everyone's waiting on me and then like they all get mad because um, I'm barely like getting dressed or something. Then I like to check Instagram. I'm just liking some posts as you can see. And you guys, I absolutely love your fan edits. They're so creative, and it just makes my day. Oh, and we can't forget about Chili Cam's Instagram. If you didn't know, yes, she has an Instagram. Once I'm done checking that, I will send my streaks on Snapchat to all my friends. Time to put away the phone. And like I said, I try not to go on it for more than 15 minutes. And every morning, I always make my bed because if I don't, my mom will get mad at me. And it's a good habit because, like, we might have guests over and I won't be embarrassed because my bed is already made. But, yeah, I really like to make it anyways. It's kind of fun. And plus, it keeps my room neat and pretty. I find it really easy to make my bed. It's part of my daily routine that I like to always do. I don't move around a lot, so most of the time everything is still in its place, so I don't have to do so much as you can see. And I know I have a lot of pillows, but I have a placement set up for each one of them, so it goes pretty quick. Alright, we're just about done here. Now it's time to head over to the bathroom. Here are my awesome unicorn slippers. Just gotta open the shutters here. First thing that I grab is a hair tie to pull back my hair so that the hair doesn't get in the way when I brush my teeth and wash my face. I usually have my retainer on all night, so gotta take that out before I brush my teeth. Gotta put it in the container. I'm supposed to wear it during the day too, but I don't really like wearing it. In the drawer it goes until tonight. Okay, now it's time to brush my teeth. I like to use this Colgate Optic White Toothpaste in hopes that it'll whiten my teeth more. Now, I try to brush my teeth for like 20 seconds on each side, and it usually takes me about Three when I'm brushing, I always move it in like circular motions. Always gotta rinse that toothbrush and put it away. And isn't this panda toothbrush holder the cutest? Then I just wash my face with plain water. It's not good to overwash your face, so it's better to wash it with plain water in the morning. You don't want to wash off all of your natural oils. Then I use mouthwash. It always gives me that minty, clean feeling. And I just use the cap to measure it. I don't like the taste of this mouthwash. It's too strong for me, so I'll go really fast. 
to get dressed. I like to get dressed in my closet. And if you're wondering, I will be doing a closet tour, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Here is my outfit that I chose. It's just this pan and printed tank top. And since the armholes were like really big, um, I just decided to wear something under it. But it still looks cute. And then I'm just wearing some denim shorts. Heading back into the bathroom to moisturize my face. I love using this Purity Made Simple moisturizer because it's lightweight and it makes my skin feel super soft. I like to just rub it all over my face. Back in the drawer it goes because I don't like to keep anything on the countertop. Now it's time to do my hair. I'm putting the hair tie back where it belongs. Alright, time to comb out the tangles in my hair. I always try to straighten or curl my hair, but today I decided to straighten it. And in this bottom drawer is where I keep all of my hair styling tools. When I straighten my hair, I usually use the straightener to curl the ends. When I'm done, I always unplug I'll the wrap hair the wire tool. around the hair styling tool neatly. And then I'll let it sit to cool before I put it back in the drawer. Okay, time to wash my hands, because you always have to wash your hands. And before I forget, it's time to put some lip balm on. I'm using the EOS Crystal Lip Balm. This stuff smells really good, and it works. Then it's back in the room to put on some makeup. And no, I do not wear a ton of makeup on a daily basis. What I'm using here is mineral powder from Bare Minerals. It's all natural and I like it because it helps to even out my complexion. It's not bad for my skin. It also has an SPF of 15. However, if I plan to stay out in the sun longer, I would wear sunblock underneath my makeup. Then I would just use a little bit of blush to give me some color. Here I'm using my Caradian Puka Love Blush. I'm using my favorite Chanel lip gloss. And to finish it off, I'm using this Tony Moly setting spray. It smells so nice. It's so relaxing and refreshing. Since it's always hot outside and I'll get sweaty, I always have to put on my deodorant. Alright, I'm all ready. Just gotta grab my phone and my unicorn backpack. I always like to keep my room closed. Now it's time to head downstairs to make breakfast for Abby and I. Good morning, Abby. Good morning. You wanna do it today? Sure. Okay. Going into the pantry to grab some bagels to toast. I always split the bagel for my sister and I. Drop it in the toaster, and I just like to lightly toast it. Grabbing our favorite cream cheese in the fridge here, and we are so obsessed with the strawberry cream cheese. It's so yummy, you guys. to grab some eggs and I always have to eat an egg a day and I'm just going to soft boil them so they go in this cold water first and then I have to turn on the stove but if you're doing this make sure you have adult supervision obviously my mom was there recording me now it's time to pour some orange juice for me and Abby You're welcome. Here's your orange juice in your favorite mug. Thanks. Yummy. Do you want an egg too? I don't want it. 
Okay. Yep, as you can see, Abby is starving. I like to watch TV while I'm eating. And ooh, bunk's on. <laughs> Five minutes later, our eggs are done. Just got it ran down with some cold running water. And once the eggs are cool to touch, I'll peel them. I love to eat my eggs like this because if the yolk is still like liquidy, then you'll get a lot of nutrients. And since I want to be like tall, um, this is really good for me. So I always eat two eggs a day. the dishes. So since there isn't a lot of dishes, I'll just hand wash them, but when there's a lot, we always put it in the dishwasher. Then it's time to put our shoes on and get ready to go. Alright, time to go. Okay. Abby and I actually have a play date to go to, so we're heading out the door for that. Bye. Bye. Alright, that's pretty much it. If you're wondering, my sister does wake up earlier than me. It's so weird because when it's a non-school day, she wakes up super early, like around 8 or 8.30. But then when it's a actual school day, she likes to sleep in or not wake up at all. Um, and our family isn't like a typical family. We don't eat breakfast together. And the reason why we don't is because my baby brother, he loves to sleep in till like noon, which is understandable because since my parents like their schedule revolves around him. He loves sleeping at like one or two in the morning. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also turn on post notifications so you won't miss any videos from me. And also, if you haven't already done so, follow me on both of my social medias. I have Instagram and Musical.ly. Both of the usernames are the same and it'll be on the screen right here. Underscore Jessalyn Grace underscore. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.